Imagine if every cherished memory you've ever had, your first day of school, your best friend's laugh, or that unforgettable vacation could just vanish. Scary, right? Thankfully, our brains have a remarkable way of keeping these memories intact for a lifetime. But how does it all work? Today, we're diving into a groundbreaking discovery that reveals how memories stick around, thanks to the brain's very own memory glue. In the early 1970s, scientists stumbled upon a fascinating phenomenon called long-term potentiation, or LTP. Think of it as the brain's way of turning up the volume on the connections between neurons, enhancing communication. When you learn something new, these connections get stronger, making it easier to remember things in the future. Pretty cool, right? One key player in this memory game is a molecule called PKM Zeta. In 2006, researchers found that blocking PKM Zeta could erase memories in rats. Could this be the magical molecule responsible for holding our memories together? PKM Zeta seemed like the perfect candidate at first. But here's the catch. It's short-lived. It only sticks around for a few hours to a few days at most, while our memories can last a lifetime. So, we had to ask, how does something that disappears so quickly manage to keep our memories intact for so long? To make things even trickier, neurons have around 10,000 synapses, but only a few percent of them are strengthened to store a memory. How does PKM Zeta know which synapses to target so precisely? This is where the new discovery comes in. Researchers have found that PKM Zeta teams up with another molecule called Kibra. Think of Kibra as a tagging agent that marks which synapses should be strengthened during learning. Once tagged, PKM Zeta helps to keep these synapses strong. By blocking the interaction between PKM Zeta and Kibra, we found that it disrupts memory retention in mice, leading to significant memory loss. It turns out that it's not just PKM Zeta, but the ongoing partnership with Kibra that's crucial for maintaining long-term memories and cognitive functions. Even though both PKM Zeta and Kibra are short-lived, their interaction persists over time. It's like a relay race where the baton keeps getting passed seamlessly. As new molecules replace the old ones, the memory stays strong because the interaction between PKM Zeta and Kibra continues uninterrupted. So, the next time you recall a fond memory, remember there's a complex dance of molecules in your brain working tirelessly to keep those moments alive. Thanks to these scientific breakthroughs, we're one step closer to understanding how our brains preserve the stories that make us who we are.